Uh, as you can see here, this is Edu Yar. I I started this company when about the last in the last month of 2022. So this is a tech startup that makes your education interesting. So I'm gonna give a little bit of information about me before I start it, about my startup. So my name is Nazim Aliyev. I'm 16 years old and I live in Azerbaijan, Baku. And my main goal in life, uh, which is sometimes uh, really strange for others, is to change the world with technology. I know that this is hard, but I think that if I put my mind to it, I will do it. And I also have really good ideas about technologies that might have impact on the world. So I will say that this is one of them. And here's the problem that I saw in the world. So statistics have shown that students often get bored by a topic or subject because they are unable to visualize it in schools, universities, at any place. So, and this problem can have a bad impact, not just in Azerbaijan, my country, but also on the entire world. So one of, one of the most common reasons why students get bored is because they don't understand the topic fully. And that's why we decided to solve this problem with our new tech startup, EduVR. So solution, uh, after a long period of research on the internet, we came up with a great idea to inspire students while having a fun. I want to introduce you to VR. Uh, so this platform where students can learn, build, talk, have fun in virtual space with VR. This just imagine like this is another, another version of the metaverse, but uh, its purposes are different and it has other features. So this is statistics uh, that I got from people for more than 50. And I did this through Google Forms. I asked them whether they believe that this VR technology can make education more exciting and engaging. And as you can see, about 85% said yes. And also about for about 50% told that distant education is good. But I will say that this is the full distance education because when you go to that platform, you can also create your own 3D body like model. And that's, I think, the advantage for others too. Market size. Uh, as you can see here, there are a lot of big numbers, but I just want to mention that these students are like the, about more than 1 million 5,200. Like this, all whole numbers are like approximate, but I would rather say that they are, they have really good impact on our market size because I know that there are a lot of high school students, university students, and especially teachers on the world. And I believe that all of them would like to try this new technology because everyone like wants to change the education system. We, we saw it like everywhere on the internet, on the reality, like on the interviews, and they will definitely try that. So that's why I say that our market size is pretty big product. So we are currently working on a platform, the main platform that is gonna uh, work like by downloading it. It's not website or app, uh, and it's gonna work from computer. But we built a demo website to show in some places. I would like to show you actually that. Okay, so this is a website. This is like the basic website, and we are gonna improve it. So we mentioned here our features about us, statistics. So here is the information about the project. And also I'd like to show you the space, how approximate it's gonna look in classes. Just... Yeah. 
So as you can see here, just imagine that there are students like standing here. I mean, I will say that they understand the topic fully. Like for example, if chemistry teacher wants to teach them about atoms in the normal class, they would just discuss it and they would visualize it, which is, I see as a problem. But here they would like even can pick up this atom. I mean, because it's 3D model. I mean, they can do like anything they want. That's the benefit of it. Okay, uh, and this is another example. This is mechanics class. It's about the same, but it's better. So when it comes to business model, we sell our services worldwide and take commissions from our partnerships with other tech companies. So I came up with the three ways to make money. So one of them is to do like, let's say for from one month of usage, $50 for six months, $275 and for annual $545. And there's a reduction between the like the money so yeah it's it's better to get like for annual or six months packet the second way is that we will get five percent from teachers every month for taught lessons on our platform i mean we all know that it's not only schools and universities that give education there are a lot of teachers also like doing it in person for them, uh, like not for school. So I think that they will also like to try this new technology. And like, instead of this first packet, they will use this one. And another way is from getting money from companies for every attracted custom from AWR. And I'm gonna do this with per plague of one cent. Here you can see competitive advantages. So I listed here one of the most like the competitive advantages are that are virtual environment, no limits, and you can make your own 3D models. So first one uh, is like it will help you to cre create a virtual space so that everyone could join. Then you can do anything you want, including showing and explaining atomic structures or I don't know if you if you are in a history class you could you could show some some like uh some place or situation how it went in 3D model. No limits. It's not only for students, everyone can use it. Every school, university course or any educational space but as I said, individuals also can do this, but it's probably going to be teachers too. You can make your own 3D models. Everyone in the virtual space will be able to create their own 3D model, which they can use to explain or show anything they want. I see this as a big, huge like impact on the world uh, because just imagine that you can do, you can show anything you want like in, in the real world it may it may need like the resources to do that but here you will just create it with a 3d model so i think that has something to do with that uh well this is information about me and the startup if you want to contact us this is our emails and this is my linkedin account if you want to take it I will be happy to connect with you. All right. Very interesting. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you very Thank much. You. Unfortunately, because of the technical delays, we don't really have like much time to, to uh, ask you further. But uh, now that we have your contact and your, your, your email and QR code, uh, eventually this is going to be edited also as an individual video. So everybody's going to have access to, to an indexed uh, version of this. 
So uh, it looks great. It looks great. Keep the good, the good work. And I hope that, that your startup develops. All right. And we'll be in touch. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, thank, you. thank you. Thank you, Ali. Uh, Aliyev, uh, just one small uh, thought for you. When you are making this kind of an presentation pitch, you should also consider who are your competitors in the market because that is where you will be able to present what is your edge that you have got against the competition because this space, the education VR has got a lot of players from different parts of the world. So you should be able to say what you have got, which is different from the competition that will add value to what you're doing. Okay. Just remember that when you're presenting it so that it would be easier for people to understand you versus the competition and why should they come to you? Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Good day. All right. Yes. Well, have a good day.